Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some popper slivers. Let's jump into things here with a bit of a flooded hand. Um, it's got two lords and a vines. I'll keep it. I'm not fond of it, though. Not at all. Keep. We're on the draw. Let's see what we can get. Mortuary Mire. Okay. Well, we get another Lord. So, interesting. We'll just keep dropping them. Artifact land. Alright. Thraven. Inspector. Alright. Journey. It's unfortunate. Get your one attack in. Predatory. Well, we have more where that came from, so let's throw out this other sinew. We'll hold up vines. And we'll go from there. See if this helps us any. They may have another way to deal with it on their turn. Yep, they did. Fair enough. Well, we got two more in hand, so. Pajuka Bog. And a flanking, which isn't bad. We had lords for days, I'm sorry. Lay off me, bro. Phetic Prism. Lint Hawk. You gonna replay that prophetic prism? I'll oh, just drop another Glint Hawk, okay. Oh, it's not bad. And flanking. Yes, I will be attacking. The 
We'll take four. Let's see if they remain on defense or not. Now we got things out of range of Lightning Bolt, which is nice. Oh, my back hurts. Sure. What are you doing now? What you tapping for? Okay. I'll take eight. It's fine. I'm hitting you for a lot next turn. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we'll begin sideboarding now, thank you. <laughs> All right. Uh, I guess I uh, could throw in some natural states. Take out uh, Sentinel and maybe one Vines. I don't want to leave anything else. Actually, we can cut back on a journey. Yeah, let's run it like that. Felipe. This is a terrible hand. Absolute garbage. We'll keep it. It's not great either. Oh. It's your sleep, but it will keep me from his heart. And I'll try to. We're going to get rid of one of our forests. That way we can cycle the tranquil thicket for something else. I think we'll lead with that too. Hopefully we'll just draw into our planes. Alright, good. We're even on the turns. They're taking their time getting their mana right too. Winding way is not bad. Fortunately, I'm you know, I can't do anything for this turn now. But it's nice that we have a lot of lords. Probably could have swapped that, played the blasphemy sands first, then put down the force uncycled. And then at least we could have played a plated or something. Uh, it is what it is. Artifact land into Glintenhawk. Let's see. Yep. Sidewinder, huh? Let's play out a lord. See if it survives. We'll bait out their hand a little bit, see if they've got removal. And if we get another planes, we're definitely dropping the double plated. Get stuff out of range. Oh, that two damage is all you. Good. No removal, so we just need to pull into a planes here. 
then I'll be pretty happy. Oh, well, great furnace comes out. Another glint hawk. So they still could have the lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. There it is. We'll play our, play our flanking out and uh, just wait till we can drop a bunch of. Oh, new product. I don't. I don't care about my new product. Thank you very much. Put me back into my game. Thank you. Oh, it just pulled me completely out of that. That was annoying. Still got a full hand of cards. Dramatic Blast, alright. Give me planes. Not the worst thing ever. We can at least play it out and have a little bit of protection for a turn. We'll attempt to get this going. Protect him for one turn and then uh, be able to get out of range. Still gonna be taking four again, which isn't fun. Cycle away. Go to twelve. I mean, no. Not gonna happen. Ah, you journey it. Well, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, we could pull into our natural state. That'd get us our board back. Get a forest. Not exactly what I want to see here. Guess we'll go plated, plated, and then uh, winding way to finish out our turn here. Our life total is getting low. Let's see what we discarded. All right. They definitely have the clock on us, which is unfortunate. Things are just running us over. Don't tell me you got more removal. Alright, 
Anchor Well Springs. Sure. Raven. So much value. Absolutely ridiculous. Now we can drop everything. Empty our hand. Actually have a board finally. Now we can start attacking back in. Will it be enough? Can't block the flying yet. Get your Thraben out of here. All we gotta do is try to race. On a two turn clock. Okay, pulling back out their Thraben inspector. It's fine. I saw it. Thank you. I'm just going to draw their cards away. Raven. Absolutely. What are those other three cards in your hand, huh? Ooh, ooh. I was gonna say, he's got me so close. I really need a spinner right here to save me. Muscle's not really gonna do it. Help keep the pressure on, but, uh, I mean, we're dead. It's unfortunate. We almost had the comeback. Almost. But maybe there's a chance they'll skip their attack step. Managed to make it a pretty even game. Bringing them to one life, which is ridiculous. But, fortunately, it's all she wrote. We'll let them play it out, though. Like I said, maybe they'll accidentally skip through their, their main here. Gain two life, sure. Let's go to the next game. <laughs> uh, I like what we had set up, I think. Is there anything else I want? I don't think so. I think this is fine. Let's go to game three. That was a close one. Yeah, I like this. Keep it. <clears throat> Come on, we're off to the races. Alright, that's good. Ooh, another Viverlint. Ooh, buddy. Alright, let's drop our bodyguard. 
We'll start doubling up on poisonous. And our benevolence is really going to help us here because they won't be able to take out our benevolence very easily on turn two. Excellent. Now you've got choices. Next time a green source to this turn prevent that damage. Oh wow. That's pretty good. I don't have the mana for it right now though. So let's put down our sinew then. Start getting our white creatures out. Oh yeah, that's a lot. If we can just keep getting white creatures, we can be perfectly fine with this game. We've almost almost got lethal. Almost. What are you gonna do, Felipe? Felipe, Felipe, I'm sorry. Glen Hawk? Yep. Well, this is good. We got a white source. That's exactly what we need. Get things out of range of lightning bolts. Also a good thing. We're gonna make them pay for this every time. So they can actually put it on this. Okay. So they have to pay for it twice in order to deal with. Alright. See? Next from the source of your choice. Okay. For some reason I was thinking it was just like all green permanents. If it's dealing damage to you. Whatever. But no. They actually have to pay for it twice in order to deal with all the green. So. They'll get rid of the Glen Hawk, obviously. And they got a lot of work to do this turn. I don't even know what they can do this turn. It's really tough. Well, this benevolent bodyguard is coming in clutch right now, just saving us from anything they might drop down. And they're going to have to block two white creatures and pay for three green creatures. Pretty gnarly. Get a blocker. All right. means uh one of our greens getting through and unless they can get something else down we uh basically have this game wrapped oh it's a wrap cancel that actually i didn't mean to swing in with benevolent bodyguard oopsie daisy Yep. Okay, for the next one. Oh, let's see. I just need to get two of these in here, so I think we're good. 
Yeah, we're good. Make your block. <laughs> For flare. <laughs> GG. Owie. That hurts. Good game. Good game. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, Border Sagro is always a good matchup for us. You can always have decent games with that. That's the first time I've gone up against the Circle Protection uh, get-go, but man, uh, the Double Vivalent with the Benevolent Bodyguard really was the game changer. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for more Popper Slivers coming up, and uh, subscribe for more, and leave a like on the video. It tells me that people are still interested in watching, and we will see you guys in the next one.